what's going on guys it's some michael here and i'm back with another video of cars Lights. and finally the jailer is at the deck to 34 with the maximum uh maximum talent maximum insignia and the second highest second square insignia with the max gear except the relic everything is almost the mess max like the equipment eight out of ten coming over glass is here and the reason i will tell you why the coming over glass is very important on this hero not the holy conviction they both are the good but here you can just try coming over glass and i will give you the reason so just don't skip this video and trust me this hero is not just a normal hero it's just a broken hero one of the it is like one of going to be the one of the best team support hero and in this video i will show you the fight with infernal jailer and without the infernal jailer so we can actually see the difference why this is the crazy hero so let's just start without wasting your time so first i am going to let's just try the solo with this and for the solo revive just don't work for the solo your hero should not die at least one time so revive is basically the useless and if you just planted to wanted uh, the timeout battle or the solo battle the coming over glass is useless here for that you guys need uh, damage reduction and holy conviction is for that purpose like the timeout battle but i'm just considering this hero as a pure supportive type so supportive heroes should have some quality some have some insignia that can actually help holy conviction will not help the team let's just try this eden fc and directly near to this calastica wow we just almost lose him just one shot by the malfica basically the solo hero is uh, not a thing to, in today's game maybe if we had the holy connection the result would have different here ah it's not working the one versus one I mean the one versus five let's just try one more time and removing this asian inside is also not it is like the supportive things uh should we go for this one the time jump will reduce the skill go down by 1.5 second and also increase the hp no he is, it's not helping he's just getting the one shot you know why we are getting the one shot the reason is the specter instinct if you notice we are just getting hit by the specter instinct in the start of the battle just look at that see that did you notice that was the main reason let's just try on another base uh this hero doesn't have the good defense let's go on this noob ia mm, where is the melfica calastica let, let's just try near to this calastica and this eradica nice he survived he survived on that base the specter instinct was the main reason that we just lost in start of the battle otherwise the same result gonna happen this hero have the only two good heroes on the base otherwise the other are the guild war heroes so but it is the against the calastica and this uh, okay it is the malfica not the seratica wow this is good tanking against the two mighty dragon the calastica and the seratica i mean the uh, malfica okay he just dead survived quite well but now let's just find how beast he is in the team fight for the team fight you guys will need the revive and the action inside okay now i'm just giving you the reason why i am saying that uh, holy connection is not good for the team fight because holy connection uh, in, uh reduce the damage reduction by the almost to 75 percent but you guys will not need it in the team fight that but here with the coming over glass this management silence all nearby friendly hero for three seconds the silence is the most important things in this days and also restore hp equal to one two two percent attack to the friendly hero with the lowest hp 
so it's like the support you type as i said like they're gonna silence enemy heroes and gonna heal the lowest hp one hero similarly the action inside is here so that we can inflict inhibit on the enemy heroes so that's why i said the coming over class will work better in the team fight now let's remove this guy and use shadow baron almost have the same defensive type capability and we're gonna just hit uh, the beast player of castle not normal player or not the mid-range just a beast Existent REV is one of the best player of Cosmetics, one of the best. Just gonna drop all together. Okay, nice going right now. We lost, we lost just one Melfica proc and we all just dead. The all heroes just dead here. Okay, he has everything and we just lost this battle we just managed to kill the one hero only let's just try again the same way same thing so we're gonna actually find that maybe it was the luck that he won now we need to find out of five out of how much battle we won with uh, with uh, infernal jailer and without infernal jailer right now we gonna win this battle i guess yeah we're gonna win this no he's melpica what the hell is this melpica man he just killed my whole team and he's still there he killed he killed everyone let's just go again third time he has the raw specter on the base than the melpica and here the Lumina is here, the Shadow Baron. No, it's the Dread said, not the Shadow Baron. Okay, we killed that Malfica, so I think we can win this time. We can win this time, yeah, we, we're gonna win. Okay, out of three, we managed to win one time. Okay, we won, I consider, because we killed already four heroes, so it is going to be the easy win. So this is the fourth time we're gonna try without Infernal Jailer. Okay, I think we're gonna die in this match because he has everyone and we have just Melfica and the Saratica. Okay, we lost. So four out of three we just lost. Let's gonna try last time. Okay, we're gonna lose this time, I guess. No, we are winning. We are winning. Yeah, we won. We won. So, 5 out of 3 time we lost and 2 time we won. The game was just crashed for a while and just couldn't start the blue stack in the PC. So, let's just remove the shadow baron here we had the five out of three blows and now we gonna try with the mighty and the same base we're gonna try it's a still lagging very much i don't know why what happened to blue stack just look at this how easy fight it was because if you notice the HP bar of my team, they just have not lost anything. That seal is going to be the very annoying in the team fight. Trust me. Coming all guys, helping him to silence the three enemy heroes, also healing the low, lowest HP heroes. So action inside gonna inhibit three heroes. So basically, this overall build is just broken. Look at this. How easy it was. The first win. Let's go for the second try. But from the first win, I think you guys understand why I am keep saying this. This hero is 
he broken why i am saying this you guys understand from the one battle at least okay we managed to kill his calastica but his malfica is still there and we know how deadly his malfica is we lost the lumina here we had the shield and with the shield that malfica cannot deal that much damage let's look at this if you notice the previous time we are playing without the jailer and whenever the lumina was died we just dead but this time we lost the lumina and still won the battle two out of two win We are losing the Kalis Seratika early. About to die, about to die. Okay, not bad. Everything is going good here. Not now, not now. We lost the Lumina, so I think we're gonna lose this. Okay, his Melfiga is just crazy. We have the four heroes alive now. The okay, who just revived my team? Okay, that Lumina, the Calastica, wow. We won. Lumina, proc. In favor of us because of the Calastica's confusion. And that revered my wall team and it's a 3 out of 3 win. So do I really need to say anything about the hero now? You guys already understand why I keep saying this. Just try this build, just try this hero and win the fight easily. This shield is just too much annoying. Easy win 4 out of 4. Isn't this is the crazy thing that is just happening in the castle dragon. By the way, in the June we will have the new dragon. So let's see how the new dragon is going to work with this tank might. This is the better version of the Evil Eye, Shadow Baron, all the tank heroes. So guys, just get this hero and it will be the easy to win the fight. And let me just show you the final stat here. It has 17 million HP with the 520k attack with 65,000 accuracy which is almost good okay so hope you guys really understand and uh, learn something from this video and uh, i hope you understand why this hero is important and if you really like the video make sure you give a like and if you are first time make sure you subscribe